<laughs> hey guys, it's Brenda from my Viva and Skirt. Look, oh, that is my portable air conditioner. It's huge. But if you know, you know. <laughs> the weather is so warm and humid again. And my hair is starting to get like curly from it. Mm, it's hot. I have a problem. I have an issue. Well, kind of. I'll show you. So when you come in, I have my, well, I have to put that away. That's camping uh, stuff. I have my bookshelf of collectible bottles. I have a lot more. <laughs> I've, I found more, guys. Um, it's downstairs. Um, my room is getting messy. And I still have more things. I have two of these. My window's wide open. I have a shoe rack with babies. And I just put, there's LED right there. I put a couple bins. <laughs> this is what I need to go through. I Let's go through that one together. <clears throat> I put, you've probably seen this on my change table. Well, it's not really a change table. It's a desk. It's my son's desk. But I have some more drawers. <laughs> And bins that I just covered up with a blanket. There's babies in those baskets. There's a whole bunch of babies in the corner. There's my elephants I love from the things way up there. My son's. My son still has a closet full of his belongings. There's more bins. More bins. There's a baby down there. <sighs> more, more storage. My, another baby right there, sitting on the chair. I can't really see it right now. I, I'm trying not to show too much of my mess. But yeah, I need, I need, I need help. I need a bigger room. <laughs> So I have this messy, messy desk. Oh my goodness. Very messy. I have Rebecca down there. I've been loving doing my crafts. So I have my craft things out and about. And then more babies. And I still have more babies in my bedroom, in the living room. So I have room for a baby there or something. Um, I found this brand new. I got this from Pat Pat. I I ordered it a long time ago. I I put a link to it. It's one of my Pat Pat orders, and I love it. So now I have room for a baby here. And guess what? I did a trade with Aaron. I'm expecting. A char I want to say Charlotte, Char Charlotte, 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 and I ha have room for baby hair. So, and I oh my goodness, guys, I have a lot. Okay, so let's go through. I want to see my Charlotte that's coming by Lurley Eagles. She will be the newborn size. So about the size of a twin A or twin B, like a 18 inch, I believe. So let's go through this. This laundry basket holds just random items. Because normally I, I like to organize everything. So I have like bins of like winter, fall. I have my Christmas drawer. 
and um I don't know, I just I just have a lot more organization. Those are all my belly plates, those are all my uh knitted items, um and more bins, like I'll have a bin of like boy clothes, zero and three boy clothes, like or you know, stuff like that. And these are like newborn boys, zero three boys, and these are like my pat pat things that I got and jackets in the very bottom is more knitted. Or oh, I have a bin of blankets, a bin of stuffies, like this. <laughs> but this I need to organize. So let's see what's in there. So I'll move this out of the way. And let's get this. Okay, so the thing is with this laundry basket. Oh, <laughs> you have to be taller. Um, I am just looking for newborn size clothes for my Charlotte this coming. Let's see. So, here, I love these kind of bibs. I had this on one of my bibs, and I put this, I had this over top. This is one of my real son's outfit, and I could not get the stain out. And I didn't want to really ruin this material, so I just put a bib over top, but yeah, I don't want to get rid of that, okay? So, here's a onesie, but I think it's too big. And, let's see, um, I wonder, I might have to change you. I'll be back. Okay, I'm going to try and put you on the floor. <laughs> Hopefully my knees don't get away. Ah, my foot. I'm not wearing polish. Okay. I do have, this is Rebecca's. It's a beautiful petticoat. And I love her in this. She looks so pretty. And actually, Zena wears this really well, too. So, this is a, um, look at the back. Oh, sorry. Look at the, the back. Isn't that beautiful? Super soft. Heart pattern. Oh, so pretty. And the inside has a pattern, too. <clears throat> Looks like that. It's not pretty. Anyways, I have allergies too, by the way. This is um, Arinda wore this. This is hers. She is my Coco Malou. And that fits her well. So I'm wondering if this will fit the Charlotte. Might be a little bit big on her. <sighs> Maybe. Well, I'll save this. Ooh, this would fit her probably. This is a newborn. Yeah, I was right. Newborn dress. Loves both. I uh, can't talk very well. <sighs> it's like a onesie dress. Onesie with a dress attached to sleeveless. That would fit her. That would look nice. This is a bigger one. I had my um, Creelin in this. And my Saskia Brin. Many dolls in this. Too big though. Ooh, this one is one of my favorites too. It's like a, a bloomer. Romper, sleeveless, summer for sure. Oh, it says zero to three. But I mean, it should be kind of like big anyway. <clears throat> this would look so cute with a bonnet. So I don't know, I'll keep it out just in case. There's a random hairband, might fit. This is for, um, 
the supreme size. <clears throat> I have this on my knoll, which is my leaf sleep kit. <clears throat> my precious paths, baby. So no, I don't want that. Oh yes, here is one from Happy Mail that I've received. It's a shirt with really beautiful ruffled sleeves. <clears throat> oh my goodness, I'm just in my throat. But yeah, it'll be too big for the newborn. These are some pants. Size 30 months, I know. Oh, this is one of my favorites. Uh, my Bryn wore this, my Saskia. It's a, uh, it's actually an Olympics. Like an Olympics is very rare. Um, outfit. There's a back, so, but, too big. Oh, this is Carly's winter. I love her in this. Carly's in the living room right now. And it fits her well. So this is a size, tell them mine, 5T. <clears throat> <clears throat> and I'm sorry about my voice. Play add music. This is oh, this belonged to Claire Rose. So this is size three to six months. So it's too big. Here's some leggings. Beautiful, too big. Here's the pants that go with that outfit. That ruffled one with the pink. This one could probably fit Alindy or Rebecca. This is my real son's um, baby valance. I have a valance in all the rooms. But, um, like in all the bedrooms. Except for ours, we have real curtains. But for my kids. But this was my real, my... Sons, Brendan's of Valance, and then Eric's of Valance when they were young. So I was going to put it up here in the nursery, but I don't know. <clears throat> oh, I remember this. This is so cute. This is a winter newborn. Even a preemie would fit in here. <clears throat> it's a snowsuit. It's so soft. <clears throat> <clears throat> sorry about my voice. I'm sorry if I'm talking. It's just I have allergies and I got a lot of... <sighs> this, I don't want to talk disgusting, but... Yeah, I need to swallow a lot, basically. I remember this came with Bren. My Saskia. She looks good in that. Yeah. Too big, though, for her? Oh, here's a shirt. Or a jacket. Sweater. Look, even that was cute little real pockets. This is newborn. Not my fitter. Here's a boy. Oh, I remember this. This is Happy Mail from Reborn Huggles. Years ago. Some cars. Little camper. A man, I guess. And it comes with. These are rose BB. This fits my Elise kit very good. I named him Caden. He's in the bedroom. <clears throat> of course, I have to have the window wide open. And um, what I'm allergic to is right outside this window. <laughs> Not very brightly. <laughs> this is um. This belongs to Jockster. He is my alternative uh, Christmas baby. Ooh, this looks so good. I had this on Felicity before. It looks so pretty on her. It's a and my cat's look. She is my Inuit baby. And it goes with this long sock. I get six string long. <laughs> Hat. We call them toques. Oh, 
Oh, yes, and there should be another one of these. <clears throat> should be somewhere. Let's see. No. Okay. My knees in the way, sorry. Okay. This is, oh, isn't this theme Thursday? The giraffes. Here's a giraffe outfit. This is too big for a newborn. Yeah, I was right. It's cute though. It's like the only thing about you being like this is I can't really see the outfits. Some bloomers. Too big for a newborn. This is one of my real son's receiving blankets. It's really old. This is a receiving blanket, newer. <clears throat> oh, I remember this. Okay, I'm just trying to swim. This is a sleeper. Winter. Here's the other one. I knew you'd find it. It's a bunny diaper cover. Oh. <sighs> I remember this blanket. It's one of my favorites. She keeps this out. I like it. Not newborn. This is not newborn. It's pink camo. I love this on uh, Danielle. She is my Greta kit. <clears throat> oh, here's a camping. My campers. They have like different tents, camper van, whole bunch of different camping icons. It's a campfire, trees, bears. So this is one of my it's a sleeper. <clears throat> Not newborn girl. Oh, here's some tights. For a girl, for a bigger girl, probably for Rebecca or Ella D, my bigger toddler girls. Well, I remember this. This came with my Chick Lake kit by Marita Winters, <clears throat> who I tried to sell a few times. But I mean, but this is gorgeous. It's like a diaper with, a... and it comes with a hat too. Like a bonnet and booties. <clears throat> Here's some more pants. It's from my Joxer. Joxer is half clown, half human. Oh, this is where that bonnet is. Oh, I love this outfit. This outfit is so beautiful. It's like a, a jumper summer jumper and Danielle wore this. She looks so pretty in this. It's like a Spanish knit. Well, it's not knit, but Spanish style bonnet. <clears throat> Here's a boy's jacket. Polar bear. Fleece. Comes with little ears on the top. Cute. This is just one of those um, no sew pillows. <clears throat> so much fun to make, so easy to make. I made this, I was going to make this into a reborn bed, another one. So, oops. And I was going to use this as the bottom. <clears throat> Here it is. Here's that romper that goes with. The, that bonnet that Danielle was wearing. Oh, she looks so cute. This fits her perfectly. I got this from Pat Pat. If you can see. Sorry. It's not a very good video, guys. Sorry. This is cute. I bought a couple of these. They're like, this is a little kind of bunny for a shelf. <clears throat> this is a hairband. This is a hairband. I should. These are some pants. 
for a newborn boy. Laundry, <laughs> laundry, uh, bounce, dryer sheet, well, a random bag. And, oh, here's a booty that goes with that outfit. <sighs> wonder where the other ones are. And these two go together, they're slippers. I wonder where the other booty is. Here's some random socks. Here's another. Oh, this came with my Nora. Uh, she by Ash and Drake. And a washcloth. So, I guess I don't have... We'll keep... Yeah. So, that's it. I only had a few newborn-sized things in here. It went so hot here again. It's like 32 with the humidity. Oh, my God. So hot. When will it be fall? Come on, camp. It's all right. I want to... I want fall to come. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I'm just, <laughs> so anyways guys, sorry for the video was not very good, sorry, I have allergies, I'm sneezing, coughing, oh, my face is starting to get poofy, I have the window wide open because it's so hot, I'm sweating, and I'm right beside the stuff I'm allergic to. Yeah, I'm not very bright. <laughs> I do have stuff. <clears throat> but I wanted to spend some time in, in this dolly room. I mean, I know it's, it's crowded as a lot, but I mean, I love it. I remember walking, or not walking, watching a video by Graphic Unicorn a long time ago and her nursery I loved it and her room she had a room bigger than mine but it was also like sectioned into sections and I really loved it she had a lot of stuff she had a large collection too and I still loved it and I kind of so that's why I don't mind these bins here at all I would probably cover them more so that they're not just like looking gray but <clears throat> like these these ones here, I mean, like I might just cover it more with something like this. <clears throat> so I don't mind that. Like, and then if I could vlog, like, I don't have to walk back in there, but maybe move this closer that way so I can walk in there if I had to. Oh, <laughs> talking to you without. <laughs> um, so news. Hope that you're having a good day. Thank you so much for being here, guys. I hope that you're not as hot as I am. Oh, my goodness. I hope that you're more comfortable than me. School starts next week. I can't wait. So excited to see new faces <clears throat> among the staff. That is the kids that I'll have next year. I've taught them before. So I'm excited to see them again. So now at this next year, every single student from grade 5 to grade 11, I have taught all of them. And there's two, there's two classes per grade. There, there's two grade 1s, two grade 2s, two, it's a huge school, it's huge. We have a staff including EAs and custodians and secretaries and all that. We have a staff of 78. Some, between 78 to 82 so our school is really big there's 500 kids so <clears throat> but I taught them kindergarten so I used to have a group in the morning and then a different group in the afternoon so and now they're older the kid so <laughs> all the kids from who are now in grade 5 to grade 10 for sure I've taught kindergarten the kids in grade 11, I used to teach in grade 8 back in the day. So I've taught all grades. Most of them were kindergarten and nursery. So anyways guys, I am just rambling. Oh my goodness. I need to get cooled down. I need to upload you. I need to clean up this mess. Put away the laundry basket. Anyways guys, hope you're having a great day. Bye. I love you. Thank you so much for being here. I love it. 
Thank you guys. Love time, guys. Love time. Bye.